I'm actually a first generation college student. Uh, my family comes from a working class uh, background. My grandfather was a sharecropper. My mother joined the military at 18 when she had me. And so I didn't come from a family of educators um, in that sense. I think we're all educators in, in some kind of way, um, but it was just something in me. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what it is. I've always enjoyed and loved school. Um, in my youth, I've always uh, looked up to my teachers as mentors and my coaches as mentors. And, and so maybe that had something to do with it as well. I also focused in early childhood education and early intervention because I wanted to work with children and families that had special needs. Um, my family had friends that had children with special needs and I really enjoyed working with them and teaching them and spending time with them. So it impacted who I became as a professional and I've always been really passionate about education. I think these newest generations are great generations. They're maturing, they're becoming. But we've, we've handled them a tough world, but they're doing amazing. I'm in a field where you really can make a difference and I went in thinking, you know, I have a master's degree in child development. I've been a teacher. I know how to do this. And I discovered once again that, you know, not all children are coming from the same place of privilege and um, those children really can be helped by providing excellent services to them. So. The research shows us that early childhood is really critically important. So many of my teachers were just invested in me, and I think that's the kind of takeaway I, I got from my uh, elementary and secondary education was just the investment in the teachers and in the students, and then the ability to be real, um, to not try to be the perfect teacher, to admit when you made mistakes, to admit when you don't know. I think those were some huge takeaways for me. I realize the good things that I've had and I feel honored and compelled to pass that on. Um, I know when I do a lot for my students, I remember someone did this for me and I really appreciated it. And so I know when I do this for this student, they're gonna really appreciate it. We have a tremendous responsibility to make sure that politicians, that educators know what we need to do in order to make sure that this group of students has access to a good education. And that gets me up every day because there's a lot of work to be done. <laughs>